Ty, I need to make an announcement. Uh, if you haven't registered and gotten your ticket for lunch, you need a ticket if you're going to have lunch. So make sure you get that. Okay. Now I want to bring back to the stage Mr. Jay Stightly. He's represented the mayor's office and he's going to uh, give us the uh, proclamation for this year's White King Day safety event. Jay. He ran away. Benigno, can you come up here, please? This is a ghost No, I was going to, yeah, that's, there we go, I, I got it, it's finished, okay. First of all, I would like to, uh, the mayor would like to send her wishes to everyone and her apologies for not being able to be here to present the proclamation herself. White Cane Safety Day Proclamation. Whereas the first White Cane Ordinance was passed in December 1930, in Peoria, Illinois, giving, the, giving people who are blind or visually impaired, carrying a white cane, the protection and the right to weigh, and whereas veterans blinded in World War II were the inspiration in the development of the white cane orientation and mobility techniques that continue to be used today. And whereas on October 6, 1964, a joint resolution of the Congress was passed into law authorizing the President To authorizing the president to proclaim October 15th of each year as White Cane Safety Day and also to point to the accomplishments of the citizens who are blind or visually impaired. Whereas Motorists should be aware that the law requires they give pedestrians carrying a white cane the right of way, white cane or using a dog guide, the right, give them the right of way. And whereas The Texas Rehab Action Network, Department of, Do Department of Assistive and Rehabilitative Services, and the Mayor's Office of People with Disabilities, the National Federation of the Blind, the Houston Council of the Blind, and Lighthouse of Houston serves as advocacy organizations and support systems for Texans who are blind or visually impaired. And whereas the city of Houston recognizes the white cane and the guide dog as mobility tools that foster security, dignity, and independence for people who are blind or visually impaired. 
Therefore, Anise D. Parker, Mayor of the City of Houston, hereby proclaims October 24th, 2014, to be White Cane Day, White Cane Safety Day in Houston, Texas.